good afternoon children in the last class we had studied introduction of the lesson and definition of tourism today we are going to study types of tourism open your textbook page number 53 nowadays tourism has become an important field of local interstate national and international stay people like to visit national and international monuments is a type of monuments means children it is a type of structure created to commemorate to remember a person or event for example kutub minar gateway of india char minar india gate etc people like to visit such monuments other places like places of historical importance natural beauty ancient centers known for handicraft for example paitani village in aurangabad and kanjipuram in tamil nadu etc people also like to visit pilgrim places means holy places uh, industrial centers and various development projects etc promote tourism P people all over the world wish to visit both the natural and the man made site for example natural sites like a snow capped peaks beaches pristine jungles or forest means place in its original form these are previously were not much important become important location of tourist at the same time children mass media also have an important role in promoting tourism because they make special audio visual presentation and which highlighting places of tourist interest it uh, inspire people a lot to visit such uh, places next uh, tourism can be broadly classified into local tourism interstate tourism international tourism religious tourism historical tourism health tourism science tourism agro tourism sports tourism tourism based on special events etc these are types of tourism let us study one by one in detail first one local and interstate tourism this type of tourism is not very overwhelming because it is within one zone country or traveling inside the state children it does not cause difficulties of languages and currency and other official documents we can also plan it at the time of suitable for us next one is international tourism because of the availability of transport facilities like railway marine and air transport nowadays tourism become easy there is a trans european railway route aviation now brought the entire world closer to us due to economic liberalization policy the indian government number of people traveling back and forth from india has increased due to liberalization traveling people to and forth from india it is increased increased due to economical liberalization policy of india government people traveling for different purpose like studies relaxation sightseeing and professional assignments like meetings agreements etc another purpose are shooting films etc so children one need to procure means to obtain official document for traveling abroad if we have to travel abroad we have to keep all the official documents for us for a international tourism children today we stop here the remaining part we will study in the next class okay complete your assignment